So Thursday isn't, like, there's a problem with every single day that isn't Wednesday. Thursday seems good, but there is Wes's Dave & Buster tournaments. And there's also there is also Undiscovered Smash, which I know that's not New York City, but it is a Thursday weekly. Damn, so, some, you know. something, so eventually something is going on every other day of the week. There's a, yeah, there's an event in New York every day. Except Mondays? Because before that, it was just bombs, which is part of house. So. Monday is an idea, but I think we're worried it might be seen that like bombs. Everybody hates Mondays. Well, I don't see... Yeah, who wants to start off their week with Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, anyway? It's not me. I am semi-retired, and I am loving it. You'll be back for Smash 6. Yeah, do you, know, do you know how far away that is? When they I, add tails. Uh, I am loving just waiting my time. What are you talking about? It'll be out in one year. Uh huh. Switch 2 comes out in 2025. Smash, Smash 6 is going to be a launch title. I mean, Unprecedented. I mean, it took, it took Ultimate like almost two years to come out after Switch did. <laughs> yeah, Smash has never been a launch title, but they're going to do it this time. Yeah, sure. Well, well hmm. Did it not launch with Melee? Or did Melee not launch with oh, the GameCube, rather? No, it didn't. I think. When did the GameCube launch? It was the same year, I know that. 2001. No, it came out with, like, Ouija's Mansion or some nonsense like that. Did GameCube not come out in December? Am I bugging? I, I, might, be, I might be conflating because that's when I got mine. Like, I got that as a Christmas gift way back when. This is not a Oh my god! That didn't count as a re-grab? Alright. I mean, it wasn't the same character, oh, right. now was it? No, no, Squirtle landed Wait. during side B. That was my bad. Okay, Devin. Yeah. Earlier in this game, Switch tried to edge guard with Box, and I find that very funny. I'd say that's BM, but it, it, it Snake players have been doing that since Brawl, so it's like, yeah. Box, unironically, is a decent edge guard tool because it oh, is yeah. a projectile you can put under the ledge, 
And it's transcendent, so you can't even clank with it if you have a strong up bait. Okay, I didn't know it was transcendent. That's that's funny. Transcendent box. Damn. So it's not bad. The only problem is it's start up. You know, yeah. the like 90-ish frame start up. You, you know what could you know what will contest with Snake's box in the next game? Zelda's table that she spawns with her magical echo rod. That's right. Yo, I have I hope they have a scene in uh that game. What was it called? Echoes of Wisdom? Yeah. Where she hits you with a chair like Aerith did in Remake. God, that shit is so funny. Like, they... Square was in their back when they made that scene. They knew what they were doing. Yeah. Hey, everything about Remake storytelling is great. Except for one thing, so... Depending on how open your mind is. It's, no, it's bad. Shut up. You saw Rebirth also. Well, I mean, I haven't played either of them. I'm just, I'm just gonna say people just don't have their minds open and refuse to elaborate. I've seen it all. It's bad. All right, all right. What a funky windscreen that was! My goodness. The set going to Devin. Ooh, this is an interesting one. 